everyone, how are you doing? And welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Honor, and for this week's video, I will be teaching you how to write a song. So, if you didn't already know, I do write my own original music. I have quite a few um, fully written songs with lyrics and a handful that are like completely done with chords and stuff. I want to say I've been writing songs since I was 12 or 13 and right now I'm 15. In this video I'm just going to be showing you some of the things that I do to write my music. So the things that I use to like sort of figure everything out is I have a notebook. This is the one that I have right now. I have another one that's fully filled up and then another one that has a couple pages in it. This is the one I'm using right now. It's a really pretty notebook. I love notebooks. I think they're so cute. This one's corkboard. And then my best friend is an erasable pen. And another thing I have is my phone. At the very beginning, I would just take a video or um, a voice memo. Voice memos app is like my favorite app. Let's see how many recordings I have on here. 131! Other than my phone, when I want to actually like record it somewhere, I will use my microphone. This is what it looks like. It is, it's not wireless. There's a wire that goes with it. Where's the wire? Ooh, it mixed in with lots of wires. Okay, this is the wire, and it just hooks in to my Chromebook. It's a blue microphone. Then the last thing, pretty much, I use is my keyboard. So it's really light, it's a simple keyboard. It looks like, let me see if I can show you. It's just my keyboard, and this is where I will place my notebook if I'm looking at words. It doesn't like to stay open, so I just do that. And so this is normally my setup. I haven't really used my microphone in these processes yet, so we're not gonna do anything with that. We are just going to start here. So there are two different ways that I start to write my songs. Either one, I will come up with a lyric, a phrase, or just like a topic that I um, have been thinking about, or um, just like a random thought that pops into my head, and I'll write it down. Or if I have like a little snippet of tune that goes with it, I'll do a quick on the um, recording app. The other way I do it is I will sit down and have a little writing session, get out my keyboard and play around with the keys and the settings until I find something I like. And then either record a little combo um, and video it so I know how to play it later on and just leave it there or I'll come up with a couple lyrics. I've been working on this one song with my voice teacher. So that's been working on all of January and a little bit of last December. That's about how much I write a month, four to six songs, unless I'm really bored and really feeling writing. So a really helpful thing um, when you're writing music is to understand what instrument you want to go with it. So. The only instrument I sort of kind of know is piano, so that's why I asked for a keyboard for my birthday, and I got one. I don't technically know how to play the piano. I took a couple piano lessons, elementary school, early middle school, so like I know the basic stuff, but I don't know everything. So you can have no experience and still write music because that's what I did for the longest time till I got my keyboard, just the lyrics. I don't really know what I want my topic to be right now. I mean, I love writing when I'm feeling something deeply and I'm not really in that right now. But it could be like the song title has 
to start with a letter T or something and then you can turn it into something crazy so you could start with the chorus you could start with the first verse you can start with the bridge one exercise that I love doing is looking around and writing down three objects writing down three emotions writing down three adjectives and then three locations and then pick something and go from there choose how you want to start so start with lyrics or start with melody you can choose which one you want to do there are 400 settings normally when I'm doing this I just scroll to one and I go from there so we're actually going to start over with something today so right now I'm on level 211 it is called polysynth 2 this is what it sounds like I'll look up chords, sometimes I'll just... That's kind of loud. No, nope. I liked it better louder. Okay, normally you start in the middle. We are going to actually look up some chords and find something interesting that I haven't used yet because we love finding different things so you don't have songs that all sound the same. I feel like all these are very like electric. Ooh, what is this one? Ooh, glass? Ooh, I kind of like this one. Nope, here. Ooh, interesting. Why does it go like that? Ah! Is it all Ooh, wait, if we go. like it. Interesting. I feel like that's kind of more of an intro than something that goes with words. Right now, I'm going through the writing process a little bit, and my topic that I chose was frustration, so I'm going to write a little bit, and then I'll get back to you when I have a few lines. Okay, so I worked a little bit, and... It says, come on, why can't I figure it out? Give up is all I really want to do, but I can't. I've got to keep pushing through for you and me. If I really want to go, if I really want to grow, then i got to find my peace. So I kind of went along with a tune as I was doing it. So I was saying, come on, why can't I figure it out? Give up is all I really want to do, but I can. I gotta keep pushing through for you and me. If I really wanna grow, then I gotta find my peace. I know I want the come on part, but I don't really know how to transition to that second part. And I don't really know if I want that to be a pre-chorus, part of the first verse, or a start of a chorus. So I'm just going to experiment around with more of that melody, and then I will move on to chords. Okay, so I thought about it. And I decided to take out a line so it makes a little more sense. So this is how it sounds now. Come on. Why can't I figure it out? Give up is all I really wanna do. I 
gotta keep pushing through for you and me but really wanna grow then I gotta find my peace so I think I, I want I've gotta keep pushing through to be the start of my pre-course so I already have my first verse which was pretty short but I think I'm gonna slow it down a little bit so it lasts a little bit longer and of course we have the intro which will make it a little bit longer in the end so I'm just going to find some chords that I like that match that are around the area of my intro so if this is where we ended and I'll turn it up a little bit so you can hear I go from here to come on yeah, okay, we're gonna change it to glass, which is just one more up, which will be easy for me for me to hand transition. So if you go like this, yeah. and if we turned it then, There's a big gap, so I gotta fill it with something. So I think that's how it's gonna go. I'm thinking about it. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, so I'm gonna go like that. Come on, why can't I figure it out? Give up is all I really want to do. Come on, why can't I feel? Give up is all I really want to do. And I'm going to finish up the lyrics before the chorus right now, and then I'll get back to you. Here we go. Give up is all I really want to do. I gotta keep pushing through for you and me. I really want to grow. I gotta find my peace. Tomorrow I'll come back with the chorus ready for you guys so that is my song so far i will totally come back with you tomorrow but i hope you like it and saw the process of it kind of changing because i feel like it did change quite a lot than when i originally started and i originally had a plan so this is about frustration and i'll see you guys then all right guys so we're back for day two and i will be showing you the finished song from the very beginning to the end of the first chorus i finished all the lyrics and made quite a few adjustments one of the big things that i changed is i went from 216 and 217 to one like the setting one which is just normal piano um they could be done in both but i decided just like how it really changes throughout i liked um, number one better. So I'm just going to show you the keyboard as I'm playing and not my face because I don't have a table that this can really fit on right now. 
This is Higher Position. video I hope you enjoyed higher positions and kind of just got to see a little bit on this channel that you probably haven't seen before and if you enjoyed this video make sure you give it a big like subscribe and turn on those post notifications so you never miss when I post a video on this channel and I'll see you guys next week bye